terms, mm -hmm. such as you know the CS Play Live Nations, the Dream, uh, the Land Hero tournaments and stuff like that. And we were just talking about this before. We've seen a lot of heroes in SoCal, especially with Chase Me, you know, putting him on the map in this region. He just won a tournament yesterday. We have yeah. DCA in our pool. Uh, today so you know a lot of great uh, hero players in SoCal and a cloud versus hero matchup so um something that you know with Accelerado and his power-ups it really changes like a hero's flow chart he just has so many more options interesting choice going for zoom there for a reposition yeah but I feel like Cloud's actually like a really good character not like not the same way as he was in Smash 4 like definitely not but he has to play a lot more safe. He has to play a lot more like of a you know sword character rather than a oh I have big hitboxes and I could have big combos. You know you have to hit the straight hits. You have to play kind of like Martha and Lucina uh, a bit with uh, with Cloud, except for you know you have a good up out of shield. Yeah. So um, with Accelerado, there are two conversions off of uh, Uncharged Fireball into uh, He's dead. Like aerial. Yep. Goodbye. <laughs> Bye -bye. Uh, you know what happens. It, that's just another layer. Like you have to read on top of having to deal with a character with like side B and neutral B. You have to also read. And these accelerados are really giving him a lot Ooh. of mileage. Insane tech from uh, Dude, Ray okay, okay, goodbye. <laughs> and a crit. Dude, that's the second time it happened. Literally the exact same. Literally the exact same uh, instance. Fantastic Zero Death getting the accelerado and the oomph right now. And you can kind of see the power up hero once he gets things going. Because in my opinion, oh, another one. Oh, oh no. He, uh, Good mash out yeah. at 0%. Yeah, so the strength to hero is once he gets an advantage and once he has a lot of the room to kind of just, you know, play with his menu, that's when you should be really scared. Whereas for hero, in my opinion, trying to scrap out, he doesn't really have a lot of out of shield options besides, you know, up out of shield and a lot of, you know, really slow moves. So you kind of have to stuff out uh, hero a lot of the times with your longer sword, longer reach or just faster buttons to rush him down, you know? Very good zoom from uh, Jakaru. I don't know if I like that very committal side beat to maybe try to make a read there, but um, nonetheless, he has an opportunity. It's going to be a very difficult uphill battle. But a backer sending him off stage is definitely the way to start out. Only 10% or 10 mana, I should say, on um, Hero, but run up, up tilt's going to be able to take it. I mean, there was just a classic situation of allowing Hero to pull uh, of their um, spells and get their power up. So um, he was able to find Accelerado and make these long-winded offstage interactions with that increased mobility and jump height. And along with that, he was able to kind of like pressure you into the corner, like, I need to roll, I need to get out. And getting him with a snooze into forward smash twice there. And it was just a very dominant game for Jakara, really getting into uh, Rain Talon's defensive game. Yeah, you can kind of see Jakara playing very safe, and once he does have the advantage, he doesn't like to go in instantly forward and instantly doing a lot of other, you know, fast options that other typical sword characters would use. He really, you know, sits back. Fantastic already getting the oomph and, and uh, Accelerado, so this could, you know, prove a lot of damage if he could get an opening really fast. Um, and I'm also not too sure about this stage pick because Hero doesn't really have stellar out of shield options except for up out of shield. And giving him platforms to up to two is going to be uh, just another option you have to worry about later on in the line. Especially if you do get hit with the uh, up out of shield, he's able to up tilt you if you don't use your double jump. But, you know, if you do use your double jump, he's able to get to the ground first. And then, okay, shoot, I have to play juggle against another sword character. Fantastic oh. just run off forward air, too. Catching uh, Rain Talon X, recovering a little bit too slow. Yeah, Jakaru is just getting so much off of these power-ups. But yeah, it's, it's just really hard for Cloud to get anything started, especially how slow he is. His knee's not dead. <laughs> if he, was, if it crit, yeah. No, 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 no. If, if, even if he crit, I would... Please, dude. I, I don't want to believe yeah. in a world where he dies at 8%. Crit, crit psych up, you're dead. Oh, oh. He's, he's dead. <laughs> no three no. stock, but... That was a really good ledge trap. That's the best ledge trap, actually. I thought, uh, I thought, um, what's it called? Magic Burst was the best one. Oh, <laughs> the down air and fantastic job by Jakari. Just going to town with these down airs with these Accelerado combos and these traps. I, f I feel like that sick. was like like a speed running. Like, you know, any percent 2-0 my opponent using only Accelerado. Like, he got 